Why, hello everybody. Welcome to Tales of Arise. I polled you guys, and you guys said this is the first Tales game you wanted to see on the channel. And who am I to possibly argue with you guys? So, this is, again, I swear to God, this happens to me all the damn time on this channel where I have to make the disclaimer. I have not beaten this game before. I have played a decent amount of it. I can't claim I've played a lot, but I have played a decent amount. So I know... I know the game mechanically, but I can't say I know the game enough to claim that I can get through it without any trouble. I'm going to try, but you, I don't know. We'll find out. So, brand new game. We're going to make one small adjustment to button bindings because R1 is fine. I don't mind R1. It's the... Uh, it's guard and evade that's going to be a problem for me. I want... L1. There it is. R1. Wait. R1. Actually... Hmm. L1. Sorry. This should be L1. Yeah, normal attack and dodge. There we go. That's much better. This is going to make my life infinitely better. Everything else should be fine. I'm not too concerned. Obviously, we're going to prioritize frame rate because <laughs> a Tails game not running at 60 FPS is a travesty and should not be allowed. Anyways, let's begin. Ages long past, it was believed that Mother Dana was indestructible and everlasting. Rena, on the other hand, was thought to be the domain of the gods, a paradise where the souls of the departed could rest forevermore. Oh, how wrong we were. In the face of Rena's unimaginable technology, its soldiers, clad in huge, shining armor, and its fearsome beasts, known as Zugles. The prosperity and bounty of Dana all but disappeared overnight. That was 300 years ago. The world of Dana fell under Renin rule, and its new masters split the land into five distinct realms. And now today, Orbis Calaglia, one of the Renin's five realms. It is ruled over by the tyrant Balsam, Lord of the Fire Master Corps. Unrelenting fire scorches this barren wasteland. Dust storms course over the rocks and crags, and no relief is to be found from the oppressive heat. The Danon people toil as slaves. Day after day they suffer under the ruthless oppression of the Renin soldiers with only one hope of escape. Death. Only in death is their agony finally brought to an end. They have forgotten what it means to be free. So complete is the Renin's domination.
that pointing? Put some back into it, embedded. Why you? Let me. <laughs> what is this? Some kind of slave support group? Mind your own business, you worthless- All right, third squad! Time to regroup! <laughs> Go on, get moving! Iron Mask? That's okay, Cole. Are you hurt? No, I'm fine. Iron Mask, you... you're bleeding. Hmm? We need to get you looked at by Doc. That bad, huh? You're safe and sorry, I suppose. Damn. So, uh, first rule, being poor sucks. I don't think you need me to tell you that, but just in case you were curious, uh, this, and, uh, this game and Tales of Vesperia prove being poor is terrible. Uh, secondary, being a slave is even worse. I'm sorry, Iron Mash, you got hurt because of me. Don't sweat it, kid. It's not like I felt anything. But that's why Doc tells you to be extra careful, doesn't he? Yeah, but at the end of the day, I chose to stick my neck out for you, and I don't regret a thing. So don't sweat it, Cole. All right? All right. Thanks. So, time to go talk to Doc. I doubt Doc's gonna like what he sees. Honestly, as fucked up as you are, I don't think anyone would be happy to see you now. Ah, you again. Sorry to trouble you, Doc. Look after yourself, and there'd be no need for sorries, would there? Now sit. So, still unable to remember anything, I take it? Blank as always. Nothing but that strange dream. No face, no memories. Unable to feel pain, yet only too eager to take on everybody else's. What will we do with you? Here, let me see. You may not be able to feel pain, but that doesn't mean you can't be wounded, just like everyone else. If you're not more careful, you'll wind up dead without even realizing it one of these days. I watched another slave die today. More corpses than I care to count. Unfortunately, that's hardly a rare sight around these parts. Danons are always dying, and the Reddits just watch. How long can this continue? Why doesn't anyone stand and fight? Keep your voice down, will you? <sighs> if only it were so simple, my friend. There have certainly been uprisings, all right. Three centuries worth of the damn things. As for all the good they've done, take a look around and judge for yourself. There. That should just about do it. Now, do me a favor and try to stay out of trouble so the wound doesn't open again. Doc, back when I knew nothing, you were the one who taught me just how things work around here. You know I'll always be grateful for that, but I can't just... The race is won by the calm and the steady. You're still young and you have time. Wait for the right moment, both for yourself and the world. Work will be wrapping up for the day soon enough. Don't sit around here. Go out and feel the breeze against your skin. Even a slave's entitled to that. Just do me a favor and keep a low profile, all right? You stand out enough in that mask as it is. Guess I'll go back to my room. All we can really do. Are you okay? Oh, yeah. Thanks for saving you earlier. Yeah, I bet. 
The bright eyes stick these weird stones on our bodies and then work us to the bone till we're dead. And as if the routine, the routine beatings from them weren't enough, when they're really in a bad mood, they like to sick their zoogles on us. Jesus. So what you're telling me is, uh, you guys are fucked. What are you looking at? You're looking to get your ass kicked too? Probably. Yo, are we just not gonna clean up? Oh god. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. I, I'd almost prefer to be playing something else than have to look at all this fucking death. There's just dead bodies everywhere, man. Jesus Christ. Life sucks. No matter how tired you get of seeing them, you can o you can always find the Renin and the Le Leonigus hanging up in the sky. I hate it. It's like they're watching over us, keeping an eye on our every move. The Leonigus especially is something else. There's no way we can ever hope to beat the Renins when they can build floating castles like that. Yeah, gonna be honest, they have you guys beat in that regard. You mentioned a floating... Is it really up in the sky? Where? I, don't... I mean, that seems like less of a floating castle and just more of a fucking moon. Christ. Uh, how about you? Listen, whatever the bastards do to you, don't even think about trying to fight back against them bright eyes, got it? I know, I know. Not like any of us have a chance in hell of ever beating one of those soldiers or their monsters, let alone Bolsef. Shh, don't talk like this in public, you two. Who knows what they'll do if they hear you guys. Kill you? Shit. Shit, killing you would probably be the best thing they could do for you motherfuckers. Damn. You're already slaves. They can't, what, can, what else can they possibly take from you besides your life at this point? And how would, how would taking your life somehow be a downside? I better head to work. So I've got business with the freight train today, huh? Great. Yeah, sounds fantastic to me. Can't possibly see how this isn't going to go fucking miserable. Great. Time to start another day toiling away for the rents. Hey man. Hey man, we're all slaves, alright? Just you guys take it a little bit, you know bit more literally than what I'm used to. You know, being a slave to the man is nothing unusual, but you guys are actually full-on fucking slaves. How are your injuries? Don't get up or don't get up to anything too rec don't get up to anything too reckless out there, all right? Cool. He's here!
there? <laughs> Over there! Don't move! Go now! Huh? Hurry, get moving! <clears throat> Stay still! You've caused us a lot of trouble, you know. Now we can do this the easy way, or not. your chance to become lord which means you lot live and die for me the mighty balsam got that through your skulls now hurry up and bring me shion <laughs> yes, <sir. laughs> even the drinks lost its appeal someone's in a bad mood lord of Wolfie, ruler of orbis calaglia but it's wild beast you prefer, isn't it? Do forgive me. Ganabel Volkiris, what do you want? From what I hear, you seem to be having some trouble over there in Calaglia. As a fellow lord, I merely thought to ask whether I could be of any assistance to you. Enough with the false pretense. I can tell a rat when it's sniffing around. Forgive me. I can only imagine the emotional toll failing to ascend the throne not once, but twice must take. A most distressing state of affairs. Shut up! It's none of your concern. The crown contest is proceeding apace, and so quickly, I must say, it won't be long before the victor is crowned as the new sovereign. I look forward to it, and you can be sure I won't forget our little chat. Nor will I. Until next time. You awake? Who are you? The name's Tilsa. I'm the medical officer for the Crimson Crows. You're in one of our safe houses. Crimson Crows? Don't tell me you've never heard of us. We're the resistance for the Danon people. 
We get in the way of the Bright Eyes' best laid plans. The Den and Resistance? I didn't know such a thing existed. Oh, we exist all right. Though I guess we're not as famous as I thought we were. Seems like I know more about you than the other way around, Mr. Iron Mask. Is it true you can't take that thing off? Yeah. Worse is that I don't even know why I'm wearing it. That woman I was with. Oh, yeah. She's quite the character, isn't she? Zephyr should be interrogating her over in the slammer as we speak. You locked her up? Why? Why? Go take a look for yourself if you're so interested. They're interrogating her? So what the hell is going on? If you want to know something, I'll tell you what I can. Who's Zephyr? Uh, Zephyr is the Crimson Crow's leader. He's not just physically strong. He's got real smart. He's indispensable to us. If you want to know some... Alright, uh... What are the Crimson Crows? I told you, we're the resistance group fighting the Bright Eyes. Our goal is to liberate Calaglia from Rena. So injuries are a constant thing for us. It's distressing work for me as a medic. Where's the woman? Jail's up ahead. Zephyr's interrogating her now. You could check it out if you're curious, but I wouldn't disrupt your interrogation if I were you. I need to go and find out for myself. Well, shit, we wake up and there's already shit popping off. Guess I shouldn't be all that surprised. Resistances very rarely are ever well funded. Mind your business. So even if you don't mean to hurt somebody, if they touch you, they get electrocuted, huh? It doesn't seem to be poison or magic. Is this the reason Balsep's soldiers were after you? For the last several days, Balsep's forces have been getting pretty restless. When we looked into it deeper, the word thorns came up over and over again. And now, we come across Miss Prickly herself. Hmm. Drop the attitude. Did you really think we wouldn't find out anything about you, Miss Shion Imeris? <laughs> What's her name? Jeez. Look, if you didn't figure it out already... Yeah, that's right. This lady got herself a surname. Which means one thing, she was Renan, our enemy. Yeah, but she was being chased by Renan soldiers. So then, why? That's exactly what we're trying to figure out. After all, aside from the clothes they wear, there's only one way we can understand these people. And that's whether their eyes light up or not. Ain't that right, bright eyes? Big talk for someone who can't even use astral arts. Embedded. Don't you call us embedded! Look! You see the stone your people embedded in me? There isn't one. Because we gouged them out the day we swore to rise up against your kind. Not to rest until every last hey. one of you is... We Danons may not be capable of using astral arts. But it looks like those thorns of yours won't do you much good in escaping them either. Still, inflicting pain on anyone who comes near you. You're wrong. Do you think this curse is some kind of great ability? Fair enough. All I know is Balsef must have his eye on you for a damn good reason. And until we find out why... An ambush! They must have tracked us down. Evacuate his plan. Hurry! And bring the girl. Gives you any trouble, wave a spear in her face. Got it. Hey, Iron Mask! Sorry, but right now it's everyone for themselves. 
What about you? I'm going to welcome our guests. Don't go dying on me. Come on, move. And don't try anything funny. Dull sword. Well, I guess I have a weapon at least, so that's not a bad idea. Alright, so here's the menu. We can look up our character and all sorts of goodies. Uh, we'll deal with that in a little bit. Uh, we're at 27 minutes. I could probably stop here if I wanted to. Don't know if I really want to do that, though. Haven't really decided if that's something I'm super duper interested in. I will save that for later. Uh, Alright, I'll push a little further, and then I'll wrap up the video. Damn. Yeah, it looks like you just didn't know. All right, your basic command is with L with the, is with L1. The face buttons, triangle, square, and X are going to be used for special abilities. And R1 will allow you to evade while pressing the uh, movement stick. Nice. Bro, being able to juggle people feels so fucking good in this game. I actually be one of those Renin soldiers. Yeah, believe it or not, we're gonna be we're gonna be whooping a lot more ass. I'm gonna assume it's this way. Okay. Ah, dead soldier. Makes sense. More dead people also makes sense. Can't say I'm surprised. Jesus, lots more dead people. Don't try to take on any armored soldiers yourself. You don't have a chance in hell in winning. Yeah, I just did. So, you guys. So, it's not me. It's you guys. How much? Oh, I guess I don't have a health bar, do I? Nice. At what cost? Not like it mattered. Everyone's still getting fucked up. Dion V. Mayor, I merit Daymore. I hereby detain you in the name of His Excellency Lord Bolton. Damn it. Throw down I was your so weapon. close. What the? You've got some kind of death wish? Those are armored soldiers, you're- Shut up and get out of here while you still can! Step aside, slave. These are Renan affairs you're meddling in. Hey! We've got a better chance working together. Besides, I don't much feel like being indebted to a Danon. 
Nice. Combos. Combos are strung together with no gaps in normal attacks. Uh, nor, nor, with no gaps. Normal attacks have a set time, have a set limit, while arts can continue until the AG gauge runs out. Normal attacks count separately on the ground and in the air. Using an art to go between the uh, using an art to go between them can thus extend the combo. Diminishing returns in combos. During a combo, if the same art is used multiple times within four action, its penetration decreases and enemies will recover from it sooner. Continually doing so will raise these penalties, making arts half as effective at their harshest. Oh, so you only lose half effectiveness. That's it? Let's go into the air. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Taking them airborne, ladies and gentlemen. Why did you help me? What could a Danon like you possibly gain from helping a Renan like me? Trust me, I've no great love for Renans. Guess I'm just not as consumed with hatred as some. What? Have we met somewhere before? Me? Friends with a Danon? Can't say I've had the pleasure. Well, when you put it like that, yeah, silly question. I don't remember anything about my past. Don't have any clues to go on either. Not even my own face. Let me get this straight. You don't know what you look like, but you thought I might somehow recognize you? <laughs> Something like that. Guess my helping you back there wasn't as self-sacrificing as I made it out to be. Besides, I can't feel pain anyway. So it's not like... Wait, you really can't feel pain? Uh, yeah, it's just another thing I don't have. No pain, no face, no memories. I only know one thing about myself. That's that I'm a slave. What about your name? You must have one, right? Iron Mask. Got the name from the person who found me. Said that this way I wouldn't forget I had a real name out there somewhere. I see. So where to next? Outside, silly. What do you think we fought all this way for? I will see you all next time with more Tales of Arise. Until then, guys, stay tuned. I'm signing out.